Uh, before we start worship, let's greet each other. God is with us. Uh, even uh, in this kind of situation, God is still working. <laughs> even in this situation, God is still working upon us by transcending time and space. So even the worship, we're giving worship online. I believe that the Holy Spirit, same Holy Spirit, would work upon us by each respective field and the same grace and same word we will give to you. So uh, let's all stand up and let's praise God. Please open up your cam as we give praise. Continue to sing our remnant twenty four hours.
future, now we can see the way. For we are the future of our lives. For we want to see things we need to victory. But we stand in the world's secrets. And we are walking the very before us. We need no heaven all today. Next phrase is title, I offer you my floor. So <clears throat> meditate on the title of the phrase and also meditate on the first and second lecture that we received today. Uh, God gave me the uh, voice to me. Um, we heard that Abraham was born and called in the midst of the flow of Genesis 3, and 6, uh, 3 6 and 11, which, is, which are the thing that people cannot solve on their own. And in the midst of all that, God said, The Lord has said to Abraham, Leave your country, your people, and your father's household, and go to the land I will show you. So this is exactly our journey they are working on right now. Uh, we actually leave our country for Korean remnants, and we actually leave from our father's household and receive the training here. And right now, just as the praise that we sing, Remnant 24 Hours, holding to the heavenly mission, talent, we are walking on the journey toward the land that God wants to show us. But as we're walking on the journey, there is a remaining question uh, that, what, how, how can we walk on this journey? And how can we receive the strength? And how can you find the answer to go on the journey of our evangelization? But just as the title that we will sing, God didn't require us anything else. So in a, at the second lecture, A.P. Paul Jung told to us, the remnant, that uh, God wants to hear what God says to us. In the presence of God, we are like newborn baby. Uh, we don't ask for, uh, he doesn't ask for anything from us. Just as our father and mother didn't require anything from us. He just wants to ask and communicate in communicate with us. So it means all we gotta do is just stand before God and communicate with God. And the method that God has given to us to communicate with God is the blood sacrifice. What do we do in blood sacrifice? We kill the lamb and offer it to God. But that does not mean the gospel, just killing the lamb and let them bleed. That is not just the gospel. But the thing is, since we corrupted from the Genesis 3, we are separated from God and we made a scene and Satan comes to us. We didn't have any method to worship. We don't have any righteousness inside of us that we can love God, that we can give off a sacrifice, blood sacrifice to God. So pastor told us that as soon as we are corrupted, as soon as we are separated from God, God immediately has given to us the method which is the offspring of the woman who is the offspring of woman is the jesus christ jesus christ contains every blessing that god wants to give us so even we are saved and even we are worshiping right now we might fall into the confusion and a misunderstand 
that we have to offer something great pleasure we have to something we have to offer something big money or our big talent actually in God's perspective God does not really need it all he needs is the blood sacrifice that God loves us through the Jesus Christ and we are saved so he is speaking to us that you are children of of mine that's all God wants from us communicate and acknowledge him as the Lord of us so I really pray that in this situation where everything block again and everything turns into the online what do we have to do do we have to find another solution no I, I don't think so I think we have to give blood sacrifice and acknowledge that everything that is happening right now is the plan of God. When Abraham acknowledged that God has given the original blessing, representative blessing, historical, monumental, and irresistible blessing to Abraham to do his mission, which is the word evangelization. I believe that when we build up the altar and give blood sacrifice to the Lord, God will absolutely provide us the strength and the way and also the future that God prepare everything for us. So with that heart, with that prayer, let us spiritually come before God and build the altar by praising, I offer my everything.
just pray for a while before Prince had a call. God is spirit, and his worshipers must worship him in spirit and in truth. Amen. Let us read response reading number 32, Psalm 71. In you, O Lord, I have taken refuge. Let me never be put to shame. Be my rock of refuge, to which I can always go. Give the command to save me. For you are my rock and my fortress. Deliver me, O my God from the hand of the wicked, from grass, evil, and cruel men. For you have been my hope, O sovereign Lord, my confidence since my youth. From birth I have relied on you. You brought me forth from my mother's womb. Altogether, I will ever praise, I will ever you. praise you. Amen. Let's Amen. confess our faith by stating the Apostles' Creed. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, I believe in Jesus Christ, only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin Mary. He suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and buried. He descended to the dead, and on the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the quick and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, the life everlasting. Amen. There is no Jesus, we don't earn no Jesus, we need heaven. A name before his wonders were take Christ the Savior giving. We love to sing of Christ our King and early blessed Jesus. For there's no word here ever heard, so there's a sweet at Jesus. And when we hung upon the tree, he wrote his name above him. Let all my seed are risen me, forevermore must love him. We love to sing of Christ our King and ailing blessed Jesus, for there's no word here ever heard, so dear, so sweet and Jesus. So now upon his Father's throne, Almighty to release us, from sin and pain, seek well he raised the Prince and Savior Jesus. We love to sing of Christ our King and ailing blessed Jesus. For there's no word here ever heard, so dear, so sweet as Jesus. O Jesus, boy, and matchless name, thy grace shall pain us never. 
Today is yesterday the same No are the same forever We love to sing of Christ our King And hail him blessed Jesus For there's no word here ever heard So dear, so sweet as Jesus Let us all pray. Jesus is the Christ, the Son of the living God. Christ is the way to meet God. Feed us from sin and curse and give us the authority to overcome Satan. Father God in heaven, thank you for this blessed day that you enable us to gather to worship you in spirit and in truth. Thank you for the blood of for the blood of Jesus that shed on the cross of the Mount Calvary to give us salvation. And thank you for your unconditional love that transcends time and space. Thank you for guiding us throughout the week through the word of the pulpit. We give you thanks for giving us the evidence of how the Holy Spirit worked upon us and fulfilling your word in every comps and every schedule that we have. Thank you for allowing us to enter into the time of concentration to heal our fundamentals and misconception that blocks us to enjoy the blessing of the throne. Thank you for continuously healing us through your word and for making us absolute individual who possess this identity and authority as your child. Thank you for calling us a disciple without any reason and a disciple who enjoy the blessing of the power of the throne 24 hours. As of this moment, we are asking for the guidance of feeling of the Holy Spirit, open our spiritual eyes and mind to understand the message and make it as our own message. Bless our pastor as she delivered a message that you prepared for us today. Use her mouth as your mouthpiece and give her five powers and cover her by your blood. I am praying, we are praying for the congregation. May you open our spiritual eyes and mind to focus on your word and apply it practically in our daily lives. May you manifest in us always. May we carry the banner that raised it up for the remnant movement. Be a platform to continue the life movement as we enjoy the covenant of Acts 1, 1, 1, 3, and 1, 3. The hidden disciples may arise in each and every one of the ambassadors that you call to carry the banner for the posterity. We praise you and we glorify your name. And we claim the victory of this worship service for the glory of your name for the world evangelization. All these things we ask in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. In Romans chapter 12, verses 1 to 3. Romans chapter 12, verses 1 to 3. Let's read all together. I appeal to you, therefore, brothers, by the mercies of God, to present your bodies as a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable to God, which is your spiritual worship. Do not be conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewal of your mind that by testing you may discern what is the will of God, what is good and acceptable and perfect. For by the grace given to me, I say to everyone among you, not to think of himself more highly than he ought to think, but to think with sober judgment, each according to the measure of faith that God has assigned. Amen.
God is with us. 저는 예, 저는 벗어도 되죠. 성령님이 우리와 함께 하십니다. The Holy Spirit is with us. 성령님이 우리와 함께 하십니다. The Holy Spirit is with us. The Holy Spirit is with us. Holy Spirit is with us. Yes, Amen. 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 예. 자 우리 아주티 씨 안에 코비드 환자가 생겨가지고 오늘 이렇게 어, 줌으로 어, 외부에서 들어오시지 못하고 줌으로 예배를 드리게 되었습니다. So we have a few, we have positive case in RUTC. So um, you, uh, people were not able to come to church, but now we're having worship online. 자 문제가 있고 어려움이 있을 때더 음, 중요한 완전한 하나님의 계획이 있는 줄 알고 어, 온 교회는 합심이 되어서 어, 원내스의 축복을 누려야 되겠습니다. But whatever there is a problem, we need to realize that there is even a greater and better plan of God, and the whole church must unite all together and enjoy the blessing of the oneness. Yes. 오늘 우리 어린 렘넌트들이 더온 몸으로 그죠? 뛰면서 가슴으로 입술로 찬양을 한것 같아요. So look at the young remnants of praising God with, the, with their whole body while, uh, while jumping and praising God with their mouth. 예, 예, 성령이 충만한 것을 어, 제 
찬양 시간에 체험할 수 있었습니다. So I was able to say that they are truly filled by the Holy Spirit during the praise. Yes. 어, 어려운 것도 많을 텐데 어, 참 하나님의 손이 함께하는 교회구나. 감동이 와요. So truly, I'm moved to see that the hand of God is upon this church, even in the midst of lots of difficulties. 자, 그런데 어, 우리 렘넌트가 어, 와서 어, 진실되게 고백을 합니다. And when Remnant came to me and truthfully said to me, 예배하고 포럼하고 그럴 때는 행복한데요. 학교만 갈라 그러면 한숨이 나와요. He said when he worships and shares forum, he's happy, but whatever he thinks of going to school, it's only a lamentation that comes out. 아, 할게 많고 나는 못 하고 룰은 많고 너무 힘들다는 거. There's a lot of things to do, so many rules, but I don't have strength to cope up, so it's just so difficult for me. 놀지도 못 하고 친구도 없고 너무 힘들다는 거예요. I couldn't even apply. I don't have any friend here. So things are just so hard for me, he said. 이걸 좀 꺼볼까요? 거기는 켜도 돼. 예. 네. 네. 그런 랩런트들이 많죠. 나이, 대학을 가면 괜찮을 것 같아요. 대학생들은 더 힘들어요. Well, there are many remnants in these cases, perhaps. So maybe you may, you you might think that things are gonna be, get better when you go to university, but no. When you go to university, it's gonna be even worse. 명문 대학을 가면은 좀 해결될 것 같아요. And 거기 가면 더 힘들어요. Remnants, do you think that your problems could be solved if you will get into a prestigious university? Not at all. If you enter there, things are gonna be even harder. 네, 우리 어, 찬미가 하나님 은혜로. 어, 지금 현재 어, 세상에서 제일 그 과를 나오면은 그래도 직업이 보수가 많다 하는 그런 과를 지금 다니고 있어요. By God's grace, our remnant Chanmi is now uh, going to the university, and her course is actually uh, the most guaranteed course that will give the highest income among many jobs in this world. 어, 진짜 그난 예배하러 학교 간다. 그렇게 하고 가니까 어, 지금 겨우 겨우 공부도 하고 있고 겨우 겨우 그 현장에서 영향받지 않고 하고 있다고 고백을 해요. But because she is now confessing that I'm going to school to worship, so she's uh, at least able to catch up, not being influenced in the field. 예. 어, <웃음> 아, 정말 금방 포기할 줄 알았거든요. Because I thought that she would be given up early. 그런데 제가 보니까 진짜 예배 드리러 학교 가요. But as I see her, I can truly see that she is going to the school to worship. 그 보니까 또 팀이 있어요. And she has a team. 네, 뭐, 예배 시간에 줘라도 어째도 학교 가면요 만나서 같이 예배해요. Whether she slumbers during the worship or what, she still has a meet. With this, with this team in the school and has to worship. 뭐 제가 하라 말아 하지 않았는데 복음 편지 일과부터 말씀 찾아가면서 그렇게 그 현장에서 예배해요. Even if I didn't tell her to have uh, the have uh, to to look into this message in their meeting, they are finding old verses of uh, old verses from the lecture of the gospel letter message. 자 우리 렘넌트들은요. 어, 나는 예배하러 학교 간다. 그렇게 어, 생각을 바꾸세요. So the same thing for you all remnants. You need to change your thoughts. You, uh, I'm going to school to worship. That must be your thought. 그게 오늘 어, 본문에서 말씀하시는 산 제사로 너희 몸을 드리라는 그 의미예요. That is what you mean by giving your body as the living sacrifice to God. 그렇죠. 우리 어, 직장 다니는 분들 중에 직장이 너무 힘들다. 이 일이 너무 피곤하다. 그런 분들 많을 거예요. And as for our members who are uh, going to the work, uh, many of you might be feeling that it's so tiring to go to your work. 어, 나는 이 직장에 예배하러 간다. 여러분 정체성을 다시 확인하시기 바랍니다. But you need to confirm your identity all over again that you go to your work to worship too. 어, 음, 
여러분 우리 학교에서 근무하시는 분들도 그럴 거예요. And perhaps things are pretty much the same even for our teachers are working in our school. 예. 어떠면 오피스는 오피스대로 교장은 세면 교장은 세면대로 골치 아픈 일이 많을 거예요. So admin officers, principal and everyone in their own matter things are things must be spinning in your head now, right? 내가 이 직책을 가지고 있어서 너무 골치 아프다. 이렇게 하면 골치 아픈 겁니다. So but if you think oh, because I'm in I'm in this position it just gives me so much conflict that that is. 네, 제가 만약에 내가 이 학교 이사장인데 이렇게 생각하면요. 학교 문 닫고 싶을 거예요. So if I'm to think that I am a directress of this school and I would feel like I want to close down this school. 그렇죠. 이 학교는 하나님 것이야. But I have this thought that this school is God's. 그렇죠? 하나님 건데 나에게 이 일을 하도록 맡기셨구나. This is God's school and it's just that God has entrusted me to do, to do this work. 그렇죠. 이 일터는 하나님의 성전이구나. So this workplace is God's temple court. 여기는 하나님의 집이구나. This is God who direct it's God who directs all things here. 누구는 이사장으로 누구는 오피서로 그렇죠? 누구는 제니터로 임명받은 것이죠. So someone as a as a director, someone as a uh, print, um, as a officer and someone as a janitor. It's just that God has appointed them all. 그래서 어, 정말 부족한데 나에게 이런 기회를 주셨구나. So I think that even if I'm so lucky, God has given me this opportunity. 나에게 임명해 주셨구나. So He appointed me. 난 오늘도 이 하나님의 집에 예배하러 가야지. So in this, um, even today, in God's house, I will come and worship. 자, 그게 산 제사. 우리 몸을 산 제사로 드리라. 이것이 너희 드릴 영적 예배니라. 그 의미예요. That is what you mean by offering your bodies as a living sacrifice, holy and pleasing to God. For this is your true and proper worship. 자 어려움을 겪은 요셉을 보면서요, 여호와께서 너를 축복하시는구나. So amidst the problems, uh, amidst the troubles, um, people saw Joseph that the Lord was blessing upon him. 하나님께서 범사에 너를 형통케 하시는구나. And everyone saw God, uh, the Lord, the pros, uh, brings you to prosperity in all things. 너 이제 노예하지 말고 가정 총무하거라. So you no longer be a slave, but now you become a governor. 어, 영적 예배를 드리고 있는 현장에서 얼마든지 일어나는 일이에요. This is actually a work that's taking place in every field where the spiritual worship is being given to God. 아마 어, 우리 학교에서 어떤 <웃음> 어, 포지션을 가지고 있다면 다 어, 그렇게 하나님께 인정 받았을 것입니다. Well, if you have a certain position in the school, I'm sure that you have all been recognized by God in this way. Yes. 고난을 가장 많이 받은 렘넌트가 다윗일 거예요. David could be perhaps the remnant who faced the most difficulties among everyone. 목자로 있을 때는 여호와가 나의 목자라고 고백했어요. But when he was a shepherd, he confessed, "The Lord is my shepherd." 왕이 되었다고 해서 교만치 않았잖아요. And even after becoming the king, he never became an arrogant. 여호와께서 나의 왕이 되었어요. The Lord is my king. He confessed. 네, 전쟁터에서 많은 세월을 보냈습니다. And he spent much of his time in the warfare. 여호와가 나의 피난처요 요새라 그랬어요. And he always confessed, the Lord is my fortress and shelter. 예, 사망의 음침한 골짜기를 다니지만 나는 두렵지 않다 그랬어요. Even if I walk in the uh, in the valley of the shadow of death, I shall not fear. He said. 예, 주의 지팡이와 막대기가 나를 안위하실 때. For your staff and road protect me. 여러분 아시죠? 막대기는요 양들을 이렇게 때리고 이렇게. So you know the difference between the road and stuff. The road is to rebuke the sheep. 네, 뭐 좋은 걸 받았다고 응답으로 알지 않잖아요. So just because you have some good things doesn't mean it's just an answer. 네, 어떤 순간에도 하나님이 함께 하시는 거예요. No matter what situation it is, the Lord is always with you. 네, 
우리 안고 일어서는 걸 하나님은 다 아세요. Our God knows our sitting and standing everything. 기도 응답을 받았던 일곱 렘넌트들은 이렇게 산 제사로 영적 예배로 인생을 드렸어요. And all the seven remnants who received the answered prayer gave their bodies as a living sacrifice to God like this. 그래서 재앙을 막았잖아요. So they blocked the disaster. 예. 아, 자 여러분 음, 이제 어, 산 제사로 영적 예배로 학교 갈수 있겠죠? Now you can go to school giving your body as a living sacrifice and with spiritual worship, right? 우리 소망이가 아멘 아멘이래요. So Timothy <웃음> says amen, nodding his head a lot. 우리 선생님들 너무 수고하셨습니다. Teacher is a truly great job for all of you. 예. 성령이 하신 일이죠. Well, that's the work of the Holy Spirit, of course. 그 일에 우리가 쓰임 받았다니까요. But how? But our life has been used in that work. 너무 감사하지 않아요? So how thankful it is. 왜 영적 예배라고 할까요? Why do we call it a spiritual worship? 자 인간의 정체성 우리 너무 잘 알고 있죠. We know about the identity of a human being. 창세기 1장 27절입니다. That is Genesis 1:27. 하나님 형상. The the image of God. 그리고요, 어 이장 7절. And 2:7. 하나님의 생기가 있는 생명이에요. So we are the spiritual. Uh, we are the living beings who have the breath of life from God. 그래서 8절 에덴의 축복을 누리는 자죠. So verse 8, um, chapter 2, verse 8, we get to enjoy the blessing of Eden. 근데 아시죠? 이걸 다 놓쳐버린 사건. But you know this event that uh, that uh, made us to lose all to all these blessings. 그런데 우리는 이거 회복받았잖아. But to us, all these blessings have been restored again. 구원받았잖아요. Because we are saved. 구원받은 저와 여러분 우리의 정체성은 무엇입니까? And to you and me who are saved, what's our true identity? 어, 요한복음 14장 16절 17절에 있어요. It's from it's in John 14 verse 16 to 17. 그죠? 성령과 함께 하는 삶입니다. It's the life to living together with the Holy Spirit. 성령이 내 속에 들어오시겠다고 했어요. The Holy Spirit said he will come inside you. 그렇죠. 어, 이걸 정말 잘 깨달은 사람이 사도 바울이잖아요. The one who truly realized this well was the apostle Paul. 그러면서 성령에 대해서 어떻게 소개했습니까? And how how did he introduce about the Holy Spirit then? 고린도전서 2장에 소개했어요. So he said about the Holy Spirit very well in second uh, first Corinthians chapter 2. 이건 세상의 지혜, 관원의 지혜가 아니라 그랬어요. That he said it's not by the wisdom of the world. 그렇죠. 하나님의 지혜를 우리가 가지게 되는 건데요. But it's the wisdom of God that we came to have. 예, 12절에 보면 어, 예, 우리가 세상의 영을 받지 않고 하나님으로부터 온 영을 받았으니 하나님께서 우리에게 은혜로 주신 것들을 알게 하려고 우리에게 성령을 주셨다고 했어요. So we, um, God has given us the Holy Spirit. Verse 12, what we have received is not the spirit of the world, but the spirit who is from God, so that we may understand what God has freely given us. 그래서 우리는요, 예수 영접한 이후에 새로운 인도를 받아야 되는 것입니다. That's why we need to receive the new guidance after accepting Jesus Christ. 과거에는 거짓 나비, 사단의 인도를 받았었다니까요. In the past, we received the guidance from our false, de- false father, it's a uh, devil. 그런데 우리가 성령님 내 안에 들어오신 이후에는요. 성령의 인도를 받는 거예요. But now that the Holy Spirit has come inside us, we need to receive the guidance of the Holy Spirit. 어, 그런데 예수 영접하고 나서도 불신자처럼 사는 사람들이 많아요. But there are so many people who are still living like a non-believer even after accepting Jesus Christ. 네. 어, 14절을 보면 육에 속한 사람은 하나님의 성령의 일을 받지 아니한다 그랬어요. So if you will look at uh, chapter, uh, verse 14, it says that the person without the Spirit does not accept the things that come from the Spirit of God, but considers them foolishness, and cannot understand them, because they are discerned only through the Spirit. So you need to have the spiritual discernment. 
예, 육에 속한 사람은요. 성령과 함께 산다. 성령의 인도를 받는다. 이런 걸알 수가 없어요. So a person who belongs to the flesh and does without the spirit cannot realize things like receiving the guidance of the holy spirit and 그 going together. 축복을 누릴 수가 없어요. So he cannot enjoy the blessing of grace. 자, 이 로마서는요. 바울이 애가 끊어지도록 간절히 너희가 구원 받아야 된다. 라고 음? 하는 그런 메시지예요. Now this book of Romans was actually coming out from Paul's deepest heart with the lamentation and consuming passion that you guys need to be saved. Paul was earnestly appealing to you. You need to realize what your original sin is. 교회 다니는 게 중요한 게 아니라 하나님 하나님 하는 게 아니고 너희가 구원을 받아야 돼. Not just going to church and just calling God's name God. God is important, but you need to receive the salvation first. 자, 어, 여러분 우리 주변에도 예수를 영접했는데요. 어, 성령을 따라 행하지 못하는 사람들이 있어요. Even around us, we can see the people who cannot act according to the Holy Spirit even after accepting Jesus Christ. 어, 그 갈라디아서 <웃음> 5장 어, 16절을 보면요. 성령을 따라서 행하라고 했습니다. Galatians 5:16 says to walk by the Holy Spirit. 그렇죠. 어, 그 성령 네. 어, 그렇게 성령을 따라서 행하면 육체의 욕심을 이루지 아니할 거다. 그랬어요. So and then it says, and you will not gratify the desires of the flesh. 어 우리가요 어, 예수 믿는데 어, 내가 주인이 되어서 육신의 삶을 살수 있거든요. So even if we believe in Jesus, we can still be our own master and live a life centered on the flesh. 그래 그 육신의 삶을 살게 되면은 어, 어떤 결과가 오냐? And if you live your life centered on the flesh, what kind of result comes? 그 밑에 보시면 어, 19절에서 21절까지 나와요. So verse 19 to 21 exactly tell you the result of living according to the flesh. 그런데 어, 바울이 로마서 1장 28절에서 31절까지 어 하나님을 마음에 두루, 두기 싫어하는 사람들에 대해서 기록해 둔 것이 있잖아요. 로마서 1장 28절에 31절. But if you will look into Romans chapter 1 verse 28 to 31, Paul also wrote about the characteristics of those who hate to put God in their heart. <웃음> 예, 불신자 하나님 마음에 두기 싫어하는 그 하나님이 그냥 주어버린 사람들을 표시하고 이렇게 표현하고 있는데요. So these are actually the characteristics of the non-believers that God has put them that way for them to just stay like that. <웃음> 여러분 한번 보세요. Try to look at this. 로마서 1장 29절이요. Romans chapter 1 verse 29. 예. 하나님을 두기 싫어하는 사람들이 마음이요. So this is the heart of those who hate to put God in their heart. 그냥 하나님 그냥 그 마음을 내버려 어, 두면은 합당하지 못한 일을 그냥 하게 되는 거예요. So God gave them over to a depraved mind so that they do what ought not to be done. 그렇죠? 어, 한번 보십시오. 모든 불의, 추악, 탐욕, 악의가 Verse 29. They have become filled with every kind of wickedness, evil, greed, and depravity. 시기, 살인, 분쟁, 사기, 악독이 가득한 자. They are full of envy, murder, strife, deceit, and malice. 수근수근한. They are gossips. 비방하는 자. Slanderers. 어, 하나님께서 미워하는 자요, 능욕하는 자요, 교만한 자요, 자랑하는 자요, 악을 도모하는 자요, 부모를 거역하는 자요. God haters, insolent, arrogant. And boastful, they invent ways of doing evil. They disobey their parents. 우매한 자요, 배약하는 자요, 무정한 자요, 무자비한 자라고 했어요. They have no understanding, no fidelity, fidelity, no love, no mercy. 그런데 갈라디아서 5장 19절 21절에도 신자지만 
성령을 따라 행하지 못하면 육에 속해서 거의 비슷하게 살아요. And in Galatians chapter 5 verse 19 to 21 it is actually uh, for the believers well even if a believer if he does not live by the spirit his uh, his uh, act will be pretty much the same as those non believers. <웃음> 그래서 오늘 여러분 렘넌트들 어, 여러분 어떻게 하라 그럽니까? So, 너희 몸을 하나님이 기뻐하는 거룩한 산 제물로 드려라. So today, remnants, what is God telling you? God tells you to offer your bodies as a living sacrifice to God. 너희가 드릴 영적 예배니라. Because that is the spiritual worship you must give. 이 세대를 못 받지 말라 그랬습니다. And do not, uh, do not go after this world. 그렇죠. 어, 마음을 새롭게 함으로 변화를 받아 하나님의 선하시고 기뻐하시고 온전한 신 뜻이 무엇인지 분별하라 그랬어요. So, do not conform to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. 네. Then you will be able to test and approve what God's will is, His good and pleasing and perfect will. 네. 여러분 안에 성령님이 함께 하십니다. The Holy Spirit is with you, within you. 그렇죠? 성령님이 인도하고 계세요. And He is leading you now. 네. 하나님은요, 어, 여러분 모든 것을 다 아세요. God knows everything about you. 어, 어느 정도로 아시는지 한번 볼까요? So, let's see up to how far he knows about us. 시편 139편 한번 펴 보세요. So, please open your Bible to Psalms 139. <웃음> All the all remnants, open your Bible now and check this verse together. 같이 한번 읽어 볼까요? Psalms 139. Let's read it all together. <웃음> Let's read until verse 10. 시작. You have searched me, Lord, and you know me. You know when I see and when I rise. You perceive my thoughts from afar. You discern my going out and my lying down. You are familiar with all my ways. Before a word is on my tongue, you, Lord, know it completely. You have me and behind and before, and you lay your hand upon me. Such knowledge is too wonderful for me, too lofty for me to attain. Where can I I go from your spirit. Where can I flee from your presence? If I go up to the heavens, you are there. If I make my bed in the depths, you are there. If I rise on the wings of the dawn, if I settle on the far side of the sea, even there your hand will guide me, your right hand will hold me fast. Amen. Amen. And just one more verse, verse 13. <coughs> For you created my inmost being, you knit me together in my mother's womb. So, this is a message we shared from the first service as well. It says that God is the one who created my inmost being, all my internal organs. 창세 전부터죠. 영세 전부터 나를 아시는 거예요. So ever since from then on, so that was already before the creation, he knew me since. 모든 것을 아시고 저와 여러분들을 부르신 것입니다. Knowing all things, he called you and me. 예, 저주 재앙을 막을 한 사람으로 부르신 거예요. As the one who will block the curse and disaster. 자, 여러분 일부 말씀 참고하시고요. So please refer to the first message. 예, 그래서 내가 한 말, 예. So all the words you spoke, God knows. 네, 하지 않은 말내 생각 다 아세요. Even the words you didn't speak, your thoughts, He all knows it. 그렇죠. <웃음> 자 이렇게 모든 것을 익히야 하시는 하나님 앞에서 우리가 어떻게 살 것인가? So then how are we going to live before this God who knows and speaks everything? 이걸요. 음, 내가 다 지켜보고 있어. 잘해. <웃음> 두려우라고 주신 말씀이 아니라. So just uh, try to think about this word. 
the, uh, he hasn't given you this word just to be, uh, just to fear him that his eyes are watching you, so you gotta always do good. No, it's not like that. 내 능력을 믿고 살아. 그 But 말이에요. he means to tell you to believe in my power as you live. 주의 이름의 능력을 믿고 그 이름을 부를 때 역사하시는 성령의 능력을 믿고 살아. Believe in the power of the Lord and also believe in the power of the Holy Spirit who works when you call on His name as you live. 부족하지 않단다. Then it's not lacking. 예. 어, 우리 창세기 1장부터 11장, 12장까지 오늘 아침에 봤잖아요. So we received a message from Genesis chapter 11 to 12 this morning. 성경 어디를 봐도 결국은 메시아 그리스도 어, 이 하나님의 해결책 이 복음을 말씀하시는 거예요. Wherever you look at in the Bible, eventually God's only talking about just the one thing, Messiah, God's salvation, the gospel. 그냥 예수 이름이 아니라 예수란 이름은 많아요. It's not just name Jesus only. Why? Because there are so many names Jesus. 그리스도의 일을 하신 예수. But the Jesus that we are talking about is the one who did the work of the Christ. So we only call on the name of Jesus Christ. That is the name of the Lord. That is when you receive the answered prayer. That is when the Holy Spirit works. That is when the kingdom of God comes in you. 자, 어, 요한복음 14장 14절입니다. John chapter 14 verse 14. 우리가 어, 뭐 얼마나 금식을 기도했냐, 얼마나 엎드려서 산에 가서 기도를 했냐, <웃음> 골방에서 기도했냐, 대표 기도를 했냐, 그거 아니고요. So how much did we fast and pray? How much did we cry out to the Lord and on the mountain? And how much uh, did we uh, have our self separately in the room and pray to God? And how much we had the representative prayer in the front? That's not what matters. 행위가 중요한 게 아니라 그 이름만 부르면 행하시는 그런 축복이 그 이름 안에 들어 있다는 것입니다. The act is not what we are talking about here, but God has already given you the blessing that when you call on His name, He will do it already. 내 이름으로 내가 무엇이든지 시행하리라. I will do whatever you ask in my name. 자, 그래서 여러분 어, 복음을 전하고 바로 어떻게 기도 인턴십을 해줍니까? So as soon as you preach this gospel to someone, how should you give the internship of 그 prayer to him? 그 의미를 전달하고 그러면서 기도 카드를 전달하는 거예요. As you relay the meaning first, you need to give him this prayer card. 예, 여러분이 어떤 증인으로 전달하느냐에 따라서 그 현장도 똑같이 그 이름의 권세를 누리게 될 겁니다. Depending on what kind of a witness uh, you relay this to him, that power will be displayed the same upon that field too. 예, 어, 요한복음 15장 16절입니다. So John 15 verse 16. 네, 어, says, you did not choose me. 내가 너희를 택해서 세웠어. But I chose you and appointed you. 그래서 왜 너희가 가서 열매를 맺고 또 너희 열매가 항상 있게 하기 위해서. Why? So that you might go and bear fruit, fruit that will last. 어떻게 열매 있는 인생이 된다고요? So how could your life be the life that has the fruit? 네. 내 이름으로 아버지께 무엇을 구하든지 다 받게 하려고 내가 너를 불렀어. Whatever you ask in my name, the Father will give you all. For that I have called you. 예. 마가복음 16장 17, 18절입니다. That is John 16장 17, 18. Mark chapter 16 verse 17 and 18. 믿는 자에게 이런 표적이 따른다 그랬습니다. To those who believe, the, um, the signs will accompany you. So in my name, they will drive out demons. They will speak in new tongues, they will pick up snakes with their hands, and when they drink deadly poison, it will not hurt them at all. They will place their hands on sick people and they will get well. 내 이름으로 귀신이 쫓겨난다 그랬어요. So Jesus said that in my names the demons 그렇죠? will be driven out. 말씀으로만 귀신은 쫓겨나는 거예요. Because the demons will be only driven out through the word. 성령의 능력으로만 
Because darkness will be only bound by the Holy Spirit, the work of the Holy Spirit. 이 복음 누림이 우리 삶에서 실제가 돼야 돼. So this enjoyment of the gospel must be actual and real in your life. 자 그래서 베드로전서 5장 8절. So 근신하라 깨어라 그랬잖아요. First Peter chapter 5 verse 8 tells you to be alert and awake. 네, 오늘 본문에도 <웃음> 너희가 분별하라 그랬어요. Even in today's passage tells us to discern. 자, 왜, 왜 근신하라 깨어라 합니까? Why? Why does God tell you to be alert and awake? 너희 대적 마귀 있다니까. Because there is there is devil your enemy. 두루 다니며 우는 사자같이 삼킬 자를 찾아요. Just like a roaming, roaming lion, he uh, roams around uh, looking for someone to devour. 근신하라 깨어라. So Uh, you need to be alert and awake. 고린도후서 4장 4절에 세상 신이 어, 믿지 않는 자를 호미케 한다 그랬습니다. 2 Corinthians 4:4 says that the prince of this world, the god of this age, has blinded the minds of unbelievers. 호미케에서 어떻게 해요? 그리스도 예수의 주 되신 것, 그 복음을 전하는 것을 막는다 그랬어요. And so that they cannot see the light of the gospel that displays the glory of Christ, who is the image of God. 요한복음 12장 31절. John chapter 12 verse 31. 세상에 임금이 있습니다. There is the prince of this world. 예수님이 오신 것은 세상 임금을 멸하기 위해서예요. And the reason the Je- reason that Jesus came is to destroy this prince of the world. 에베소서 2장 2절. Ephesians 2:2. 공중 권세 잡은 자 있다니까요. There is the ruler of the air. 여러분 우리 대한민국은요 제사 고사 문화예요. So Korea is especially fascinated with the culture of ancestor worship and rituals. 예. 어, 대학 축제를 하는데도 고사 지내고 그렇게 해요. So even when there is a festival in college, they have uh, the ancestor worship first. 자, 어. 여기 어떤 세상 풍속이 있습니까? Then what about in this land? What kind of worldly culture and customs are here? 자, 성도에게는 대적이 있어요. So for believers, the saints have their enemy. 구원받은 자가 하나님의 축복을 누리지 못하게 합니다. And this enemy is blocking the people who are saved to from, from enjoying the blessing of the children of God. 그래서 전도만 못하게 해요. So eventually, he blocks you from uh, from doing the evangelism only. 그런데 요한복음 16장 11절. But uh, John chapter 16 verse 세상 임금 심판 받았습니다. That the prince of this world is condemned. Amen. Amen. 이게 성령님이 와서 하시는 일인데요. That's what the Holy Spirit comes and does. 예. 어, 세상 임금이 꺾여야 이 축복을 누릴 수 있어요. The prince of the world must be broken down first so you could enjoy this blessing. 에베소서 6장 11절에 간계로 일을 한다 그랬어요. 간사한 꾀를 써요. Ephesians chapter 6 verse 11 says that he has uh, schemes and with that he is working. 그렇죠. 예배도 드리고 메시지도 듣는 것 같은데 복음만 누리지 못하게 해요. So uh, even even after attending the worship and receiving all the messages, ultimately he just Uh, makes you to not enjoy this gospel only. 광명의 천사처럼 가장을 해서 여러분 종교 생활을 하도록 한다니까요. And he is camouflaging mm. like a glorious angel and eventually leads your life to just have a religious life only. 예배도 드리는데 복음을 못 누리고 육을 쫓아 살아요. So even if you worship, you don't enjoy the gospel and you get to follow the flesh only. 그래서 하나님께서 복음을 주신 것이죠. That's the reason why God gave you this gospel. 예. <웃음> 그래서 근신하라, 깨어라 하신 것이에요. So God told you to be alert and awake. 예. 어, 우리 지난 주에도 마음으로 믿고 입으로 시인하고 어, 예, 같은 거라 그랬습니다. Even last week, if you believe in your heart and confess with your mouth, it's the same thing. 예. 어, 마음으로 믿는 사람은요. 입으로 시인하게 돼 있어요. The one who believes in the heart has no choice but to confess with his mouth. 예. 그리고요. 이렇게 절대 언약 붙잡은 사람은 어, 어, 성도의 사명, 이 미션이 있죠. And the one who holds on to the absolute covenant like this has the mission of a believer. 이 보좌 하나님 나라를 누리는 거예요. It's the throne enjoying the kingdom of God. 그래서 응답, 
보좌에서 주시는 응답, 능력. 이거 하나님 주시게 돼 있어요. So he he is bound to receive the power and the answer which is the blessing coming from the throne. 근데 우리 힘으로는 그안 돼요. But it does not work by our power. 오직 성령이 임하시면 너희가 권능을 받을 거라고 했어요. But it says that you, uh, but the, uh, but you will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes on you. 권세, 능력을 받는 거예요. You will receive the authority and the power. 예, 그래서 귀신 나가라 들어가라 할 필요도 없어요. So you don't have to tell any more for the evil spirits to go out. 예, 그리스도 고백 선포하면 하나님 나라 바로 임하는 거예요. If you just confess the name of Jesus Christ, the kingdom of God establishes immediately. 그렇죠? 성령의 성령이 능력으로 역사하시기 때문에 내가 권능을 받게 되는 거예요. Because the Holy Spirit is working in power, you get to receive. The authority. 그러면 세상 승리할 수 있죠. Then you can overcome this world. 육을 쫓아 살고 풍속 따라가고 그러지 않아요. You uh, then you are to not follow uh, your flesh and live accordingly. 그래서 그 언약을 붙잡고 오로지 기도한 거죠. So holding to this covenant, you'll be able to dedicate yourselves into prayer. 여러분 복음을 깨달으면 깨달을수록 이제 할 거는 기도밖에 없어요. The more you realize the gospel, the only thing left for you is just a is just a prayer. 이 집중밖에 없어요. There's nothing else but this concentration. 예, 그래서 사도행전 1장 14절 이 자리로 간 거예요. So people went to the place of Acts 1:14. 믿으니까. Because they believed it. 정말 믿으니까 언약 붙잡고 기도한 거예요. Because they truly believed in it, so they held on to the covenant really and prayed. 그 사도행전 2장 세상 변화가 일어났잖아요. That's why the work of Acts chapter 2, the change of this world took place. 네, 그렇게 세상을 변화시킬 수 있는 능력이 온다. So just like that, the power to change the world will come to you. 예수 이름 부르면 예수 그리스도 이름 부르면 승리하게 돼 있다. When you call on the name of Jesus, you you ought to have the victory. 왜요? Why? 성령이 역사하시니까. Because the Holy Spirit works. 승리하는 삶이 하나님 나라가 가능하다는 것입니다. So the life of victory, the kingdom of God, will uh, happen in your life. 예, 그래서 어, 요한복음 14장 16절, 어, 17절 그게 우리 신자의 정체성이에요. So John chapter 14, verses 16 to 17 is the identity of the believers. 성령이 함께하고 성령이 우리 속에 계세요. The Holy Spirit is together with us, and we are uh, the Holy Spirit is in us. 그런데 조금만 의지하면요, 26절. So if you depend on Him just a little bit, then verse 26. 모든 것을 가르치고 생각나게 하세요. The Holy Spirit will teach you all things and remind you of everything He said to you. 예. 요한복음 16장 13절. And John 16:13. 네, 여러분이 조금만 기도하면 진리의 성령이 오셔서 모든 걸 가르쳐 주신대요. If you pray just a little bit, then the Spirit of Truth comes and 네. guide you into all the truth. 장례일도 알게 하신대요. And He will even tell you what is yet 그렇죠? to come. 미래 두려움 없어지겠죠. Then your fear for your future will be gone away. 그래서 24절 구하라. So 24. Seek. So ask and you will receive and your joy will be complete. 여러분 기쁘십니까? So are you joyful? 예. 성령이 우리 안에 계시기 때문에 평안은 이미 주어졌어요. Because the Holy Spirit is in you, the peace is already given to you. 예. 그런데 이것을 어떻게 누리냐? Then the thing is, how are we going to enjoy this from now on? 예. 어, 어떤 일을 만나든지 우리가 평안하면 세상을 이기는 거죠. If you are enjoying the peace, no matter what you face, that 예. means you already overcame this world. 그것을 알게 하려고 예. 33절 And 너희에게 for you, 이것을 말한다 그러셨어요. And for you to know this, that Jesus is now saying this, I have told you these things. 내 안에서 이 평안을 누리라 그랬어요. So that in me you may have peace. 예, 내가 세상을 이겼다 하셨습니다. But I, uh, I have overcome the world. He said. 자 여러분 어때요? <웃음> okay, how about you guys? 예, 예 바울은 어, 마가 그 감람산 훈련 안 받았어요. Paul did not receive the training in the Mount of Olives. 마가 다락방 그 증거의 현장에 없었어요. And he was not even present in the seat of Mark's upper room. 그런데 그 누구보다도 더 어, 
이 영적인 예배에 대해서 잘 깨달았죠. But he actually realized about the spiritual worship more than anyone else. 그 말은 저와 여러분들도 더잘 깨달을 수 있다. Well, that means you and I could realize even better too. 그렇죠. 그래서 음, 여러분 <웃음> 우리 지금 교회가 어, 73차 40일 집중 지금 8일차를 인도받고 있어요. So now the church is going through the eighth day of the 40 days concentration of 73rd batch. 네. 어, 여러분 함께 한번 도전해 보시기 바랍니다. So why don't you challenge on this together? 네. 어, 하나님 앞에서 산 제사를 드리겠습니다. So God, I will give uh, the, blood, the, the living sacrifice before you, God. 이건요. 뭐 금식하면서 하거나 뭐 정말 교회 맨날 와서 철회하거나 그러지 않아도 돼요. This doesn't mean you have to fast all day and having this late night worship in the church. 정말 이유가 있으면 금식도 하죠. If there is a truly a meaning, then you can do the fasting too. 놀랍게 흉악의 결박이 풀려요. Very amazingly, the chains of darkness will be released. 정말 우리 어, 기도 팀들은요, 아홉 시 교회를 위한 기도를 계속 합니다. The, there's a prayer team, and they keep on praying for the church at nine o'clock exactly. 여러분 그러지 못하더라도 여러분 현장에서 40일 기도 해 보세요. Well, even if you are not able to pray together at 8 o'clock with the prayer team, you can at least pray in your own field of 40 네. days. 정말 하나님 나를 산 제사로 드립니다. God, I'm truly offering my body as a living sacrifice. 여러분 공부하면서 해 보세요. Why don't you do this prayer while studying? 일하는 그 공간에서 해 보세요. Why don't you uh, do this prayer in your own workplace? <웃음> <웃음> 반드시 어, 약속의 성령의 충만함이 임할 것입니다. Definitely the promise the feeling of the Holy Spirit will come upon you. 나라를 체험하시게 될 겁니다. And you'll get to experience God's kingdom. 어, 그래서요. 어, 예, 예, 영적 배경이 아무것도 없어. 육신 배경도 아무것도 없어. 더 좋아요. 어, 내 속에 영적인 망대를 <웃음> So no physical background and no spiritual background whatsoever. It's even better because you can establish the spiritual bar design in you. 아무도 없어 성삼위 하나님이 나와 함께 하셔 더 누릴 수 있어요. There's no one, but still the Triune God is with you. You can enjoy that blessing even more because there is nobody around you. 아그 여러분 진짜 이 자리에서 기도할 때 시공 초월 어, 성삼위 하나님이 함께 하고 어, 계신다는 것을 여러분 더 믿게 될 거예요. When you truly pray in this place, you'll be able to believe even more that the Triune God is with you, transcending time and space. 야, 그렇다면 이 삼칠 땅 끝까지 증인 하나님 나를 이 일에 사용해 주세요. 기도가 나올 겁니다. If then God may you use me. Uh, 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 for the 237 until the ends of the earth this prayer will be coming out from you. 그렇죠. 우리가 어, 여기서 정말 성삼위 하나님이 함께 하시는 보좌의 축복 누리고 있는데 어, 이 삼칠 나라의 어린이들이 왔어요. As uh, we, we all we did was just enjoying the blessing of the throne in this place and God has brought the kids from the 237 here. <웃음> 저 부모님들은요. 정말 시공 초월 이 기도의 비밀을 누리고 계시겠죠. And their parents must be truly enjoying the blessing of this prayer transcending time and space. 어, 저도 여기서 시공 초월 자녀들이 있는 곳, 렘넌트들이 파송된 곳 어, 그곳을 놓고 기도하고 있어요. I'm also praying uh, for the place where my children are and where my children, where my remnants are commissioned to transcending time and space. 음. 그렇죠? 어렵겠죠. 어려우니까 더 성삼위 하나님만 바라보게 해 주세요. It must be more uh, it must be more difficult for them. But that's the reason why I'm praying to God that they may be looking upon the triune God only all the more. 저희 복음 그리고 237 살리는 미래 망대들로 하나님 세용해 주세요. And I'm praying for them that they may become the platform of the throne and the future partisan. 그렇죠. 어, 정말 전무응한 그 응답 축복이 옵니다. Truly, the the unprecedented and never never repeated answer will come. 예, 지금까지 온 응답 가지고도 
감사해요. Even just with the answers that came until now, we're thankful already. 그런데 앞으로 어떤 어, 더한 역사를 하실지 너무 기대가 되죠. However, what kind of works will God raise more from now on? For so much is expected, right? 어, 우리는 초대 교회 강상 모델이잖아요. Because the early church is always our model. 예, 초대 교회 어, 어, 전혀 가진 것이 없는 그 상태 아닙니까? Early church was in the state of not having anything. 그런데요, 어, 삶 속에서 어, 일곱 미션을 누릴 수 있는 그런 망대 세우는 그런 기도를 하도록 하나님이 하셨어요. But God made them to give it a prayer to enjoy the seven partisans in their life. 예, 어, 하나님 나라에 대해서 어, 알려주셨고 God first taught them about the, the kingdom of God. 예, 하나님 나라의 일. So the work pertaining to God's kingdom. 그렇죠. 어, 이게 오직의 축복이에요. And that is the blessing of only. 예, 보좌에서만 주실 수 있는 거. Because it's something that could be given by the throne. 흑암이 꺾이고 하나님 나라가 임하는 축복이에요. It's the blessing that breaks down the darkness and establishes God's kingdom. 그렇죠. 어, 이 응답과 축복의 범위는 땅 끝이라 그랬습니다. When you receive the sensor and blessing, you'll be able to see the ends of the earth. 예, 그래서 이제는 구체적으로 나의 2, 3, 7. 이런 so, 미션의 망대를 세워라. So now, practically your own 2, 3, 7. Now, build the partisan for this. 네. 그래서 여러분, 미국, 영국, 호주, 두바이, 중국 지금 이렇게 붙잡고 있죠? So all of you are holding on to you. Uh, all, all your countries like the United States, UK, Australia, and Dubai. 네. <웃음> 저 조지아도 그렇고 저 캄보디아도 그렇고 여러분 계속 한 사람 한 사람 하나님 부져 주시는 그 망대마다 기도하지만 그보다 더한 237 나의 237을 놓고 망대 세우라고 하셨습니다. So of course we are keep on praying for Georgia and Cambodia too and more than that God has also told you to pray for the parties of the 237. 네. 그렇게 할때 정말 나에게 주신 진짜 빛의 경제의 축복. 어, 내가 평생 어떻게 하나님께 영광 돌릴 거냐 이명 계약이 나온다고 했어요. That is when you will be able to see the real light economy that God has given you. So for my lifelong, how will I be glorifying God? That's going to be coming out. 그렇죠? 어, 정말 전도자들을 살리는 식주인, 여성 산업인 뭐 이렇게 나오는 거예요. So that is when you'll be able to come up with your double-sided contract, like uh, I'm going to be this a female business person who truly saves the evangelist. 음, 정말 유대인 3단체 살릴 RUTC 지도자 나오는 거예요. Truly, the RUTC leader who will save the Jewish people and three organizations. That's going to be come out, coming out. 천 RUTC 세울 도울 중직자 산업인 나오는 겁니다. So the one, uh, the the businessman and the uh, church officer and businessman who was uh, raised at 1000 RUTC that 이렇게, comes out like that. 이렇게 정확히 언약을 계속 잡아 나가면요. 미래가 더 확실하게 보여요. Just like this, if you hold on to the current the accurate covenant like this, the future will be even clearer. 그리고 재림주로 오실 그리스도를 기다리는 거죠. And we wait upon the Christ who will come as the Lord of the second coming. 자, 어, 예수님의 부활 승 우리는 다른 말 들으면 안 되잖아. 예수님의 마지막 강단이에요. So we're not supposed to be listening to anything else. And this is the last pulpit of Jesus. So we don't listen to people's words. We only do what Jesus told us to do. 예, 정보, 빨리 빨리 변해요. So your course, just quickly choose. 세상 흐름이요, 언제 어떻게 변할지 몰라요. Oh, no, sorry. I mean, the information quickly changes. The world, we don't know how the world will change. 너무 빨리 변하는 그런 흐름 때문에 여러분 두려워하지 마세요. But do not be afraid because of the quickly changing flow in the world. 예, 어, 알고는 있어야 되죠. Yeah, you need to know about it at least. 네, 그러면서 어, 예수님이 하나님 나라의 일 40일 동안 <웃음> 약속하시고요. And Jesus promised the work pertaining to God's kingdom for 예루살렘을 40 days. 예루살렘을 떠나지 말고 
내게 들은 바 아버지의 약속하신 것을 기다리라고 했어요. And he promised to not leave it. I mean, he told the the apostles to not leave Jerusalem, but wait for the gift my father has promised. 여전히 관심은요 이스라엘 회복이 그러면 이때니까. However, the apostles were only concerned of the restoration of Israel when was when it was. 너희 알바가 아니다 그랬어. So Jesus just told them, "It's none of your business." 오직 성령이 너에게 마시면. But you, but the Holy, if the Holy Spirit comes on you, 너희가 권능을 받고 땅 끝까지 증인될 것이다. You will receive the power, and you will be my witnesses to the ends of the earth. 예, 어, 이 세상을 살아가는 동안에 성령의 능력을 받고 얼마든지 세상을 이길 수 있어요. As you live in this world, 예. you can receive the power of the Holy Spirit, and you can fully overcome this world. 네, 여러분, 근데 세상을 의 성령을 의지하는 사람이 별로 없어요. But the thing is, there are really not much people who depend, lean on the Holy Spirit. 예, 성령은 그리스도의 영입니다. The Holy Spirit is the, uh, the Spirit of the Christ. 진리의 영이에요. It's the uh, Spirit of the Truth. 예, 정말 제대로 의지하면 은 어, 내가 어떤 사람이라도, 내가 어떤 문제에 갇혀 있더라도 상관없어요. If you really <웃음> depend on Him, no matter what kind of person you are, no matter what situation you are in, it's okay. 성령 안에서 완전히 승리하는 축복이 있을 것입니다. Because there will be the blessing of the complete victory in the Holy Spirit. 어떤 핍박이 와도 어, 굴하지 않고 미래 망대를 세울 수 있어요. No matter what persecution comes, you will not be bothered by it, and you'll be able to make the future partisan without uh, being bothered by anything. 가기도 전에 성령께서 미리 가서 준비하시고, 그죠? 앞 뒤로 천사 보내시고 다 하신다니까요. Because even before you go, the Holy Spirit will already go there and work upon you ahead of you, and He will already send the angels ahead of you and at the back of you. 네, 어자 우리 세 가족들에게는 좀열 가지 비밀이 뭔지. 우리가 든든히 서 있는 발판이 뭔지 좀 풀어 주시고요. Well, to the new believers, you have to at least explain to them about the 10 mysteries and the 10 foundations. 예, 그리스도께서는 이렇게 확신을 주셨잖아요. The Christ has given you this assurance. 예. 그래서 어, 정말 그 부활의 증거, 그죠? 어, 그 부활의 증거를 가지고 완전히 다른 인생 어, 새로운 인도를 받는 인생, 다른 힘으로 사는 인생이 됐던 거예요. So with the evidence of the resurrection, now our life have become completely a new, uh, the life that receives the new blessing and the new guidance. 네, 그래서 어떤 흐름도 바꿀 수 있다. So no matter what flow, we can change. 평생의 답으로 인도 받을 수 있다. So we can find our lifelong answer from there. 네, 우리의 배경이 보자다. Because our platform, our uh, background is the throne. 예. 어, 여러분 이 언약을 붙잡고 예수 이름 부르시기 바랍니다. You hold on to this covenant and call on Jesus' name. 예. 어디에 있든지 축복 누리는 것을 보고 24의 망대라 그랬어요. Enjoying this blessing wherever you are is the partisan of 24. 이제는 기도가 다라니까요. Now the prayer is 기도 everything. 기도 망대만 세우면 돼요. You just only need to raise the prayer partisan. 분명히 이렇게 하고 있는 사람에게는요, 하나님이 사람을 붙여요. When you are doing like this, God will definitely attach you to people. 예, 어, 왜요? 이 사람 빛을 비추고 있기 때문이에요. Why? Because he is shining the light. 이건 우리에게서 나온 것이 아니잖아요. Because it did not come out from us. 나라가 임한 것입니다. It's the it's the establishment of the kingdom of God. 이게 25의 망대. That's the blessing of 25. 그 파수대. It's the watchman. 그렇죠. 어, 그래서 어, 정말 영원한 것이 온다. 영원한 응답이 온다. So the eternal answer comes to you. 예. 어떤 경우에라도 하나님과 소통하면서 살리는 어, 이 축복을 누리는 거예요. No matter what case, with the communication with God, you'll be enjoying the blessing to save. 어린 렘넌트라도 누리고 있잖아요. Even if it's a kid, he still enjoys this. 예. 그날에 작정된 자. There, because there is definitely the appointed one on that day to receive the salvation, 그렇죠? and God will make you to meet with that person. So altogether, He will make you to go for this healing summit journey. 자, 여러분, 어, 그래서, all of you saints must remember that you have an enemy. So be alert and awake. 예, 그런, 그러시면, and you need to discern them. 예, and do not conform. 
to this world. 하나님이 기뻐하시고 온전하신 뜻이 무엇인지를 분별하시기 바랍니다. But you need to discern what is God's pleasing and yeah, God's pleasing will. 하나님이 모든 걸 아신다니까요. Because God knows everything. 여러분 장기를 여러분 모태에서 지으신 분이에요. He's the one who created your inmost being in when you were in mother's womb. 영세전에 작정을 하시고 예정을 하시고 그 풍성한 아들을 주시기 위해서 그때에 부르신 거예요. He has already set the will predestined before the long ages passed and made a plan and in order to give you all the heavenly blessings he has called you in this day. 모든 것을 아시는 하나님이 그 이름을 주신 것입니다. So God who knows everything has given you this name. 성령의 능력을 가지고 세상을 이기도록 하신 거예요. And he has blessed you to overcome this world with the power of the Holy Spirit. 자, 여러분. 어, 우리 남은 자의 여정 가고 있죠. We're going for the journey of the remained one now. 그건 순례자의 여정이에요. And that's the journey of the pilgrim too. 우리는 모든 것 기도로 바꾸죠. And we're changing all things, whatever we see into the prayer. That's the journey of the conqueror he promised us. So for last, let's go to Romans 8, verse 37. 현장 삶의 현장 속에서 산 제사로 여러분을 드리고 있을 때 어떤 일이 벌어지냐면요. So when you are giving your body as the living, uh, when you're offering your body as, as a living sacrifice to God, what is happening in your life? 예, 넉넉히 이기게 하신다 그랬어요. Um, that you become more than conquerors. 예, 뭐예요? More than conquer. Says it says here more than conquerors. 자, 어, 여러분 그 세상 정복자보다도 여러분은요 더한 하나님의 사랑 안에 있습니다. So that's right. Even more than the conquerors of this world, you are in God's love. 예, 어, 그 어떤 문제가 온다 하더라도 넉넉히 이길 것입니다. So no matter what kind of problem comes to you, you'll be you'll be more than conquerors. 모든 것을 아시는 분이 뭘 줬어요? He who knows everything has given you what his name he gave. 성령의 능력을 가지고 이기라고요. So now, just with the power of the Holy Spirit, you can join. 오늘부터 여러분이 이 기도를 시작하시면 됩니다. So starting today, start this prayer. 예, 산 제사로 여러분 인생을 드리시기를 축복합니다. So I bless upon you that you may offer your bodies as a living sacrifice. 예, 교회 올 때만 예배가 아니. So not just coming to the worship, coming to the church is the only time for your worship. Remnants들은 예배 드리러 학교 갑니다. So remnants, you need to remember that you go to school to worship. 우리는 우리 직장에 예배하러 갑니다. And for adults, you go to your work for worship. 일곱 remnants처럼 재앙 막는 한 사람으로 하나님이 부르신 것입니다. Just like the seven remnants, God has called you as the one individual to block this curse. Amen. Amen. 어, 73차 40일 집중 속에서 어, 정말 하나님 나라를 체험하고 성령의 충만함을 체험하시기를 축복합니다. I bless upon you that you may truly experience God's kingdom and the feeling of the Holy Spirit in within the 73rd batch of the 40, uh, 40 days concentration. 그러면 여러분 있는 현장에 예, 이 능력을 이 축복을 전달자가 전달할 수 있도록 될 것입니다. Then you'll be able to relay this blessing in your own field too. 그래서 응답받고 세계를 살리는 증인 되시기를 축복합니다. So I bless you that you may be the witnesses to receive the answer and save the world. Amen. Amen. 하나님 감사합니다. Lord, we thank you. 오늘도 모든 것을 아시는 하나님 앞에 언약 붙잡고 예배하게 하시니 감사합니다. Lord, we thank you for blessing us to worship before you, holding into the covenant for you know everything. 안고 일어서는 모든 것을 아시는 하나님의 통치 속에 우리가 있음을 감사를 드립니다. And we also thank you that we are within your reign who knows all things about us are sitting in line. 이제는 복음 누림 속에 있게 하여 주옵소서. Now bless us to be within the enjoyment of the gospel. 진정한 응답, 축복, 능력을 가지고 세상을 살리게 하여 주옵소서. With the true blessing, power and answer May we truly save the world now. 그리스도 이름으로 축복하고 기도합니다. I bless and pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen.
Glory to God for the message that we received today. Truly that we must offer our body as a living sacrifice. So, um, from the self message, we see the life of Abraham, that God called him um, um, from the land of war, the land of idol, the land of destruction. So, we were also called by God to give us the blessing of heavenly realms. God knew us even when we are in our mother's womb. And he called us to leave the worldly custom, come out from the shadow of Satan, who was our father in the past, and receive the new blessing. So we are the people of priests to live on giving sacrifice. So do the sacrifice of only and receive the continuous guidance of the Holy Spirit. And for the third message, God wants us to offer our body as a living sacrifice. It's a spiritual worship. So we go to work to worship and remnants should go to school to worship so our background is the heavenly throne so let's enjoy the kingdom of god everywhere we go and enjoy the prayer means let's enjoy the concentration and for our prayer topics let's continue to pray for our school ministry this 2022 and 2023 and um let us pray for our pulpit pastor, the admin staff, faculty, church co-workers, and remnant missionaries who are devoting their lives for the ministry. May three themes be established, and may our school be the spiritual platform that saves the two, three, seven nations, bring healing and to all fields, and raises our remnants as summits. Let's also pray for the Trovas Church and the Wangju Mission Home, as well as the adjustment of the students who resolve to come to the Philippines. Let's also pray for the following schedule this week. Um, let's pray for the iShare program um, at Pinalagdan High School and Lungas Elementary School. Let's pray together for this very important time schedule. And for those who want to offer the Thanksgiving flowers to decorate our pulpit, you may communicate with our assistant pastors. And also, we encourage everyone to pledge for the reconstruction of the laundry area and healing room. So kindly send, send the amount to me. And let's pray continually for the cost of the total cost of grouping. We have fourth worship at 4 p.m. And those who prepare their offering through GCash, please communicate with Mam Set. Our um, GCash account is flashed on your screen. Yeah. Okay, that's all for to God be the glory. God, we thank you. 오늘도 하나님이 약속을 붙잡고 예배하게 하시니 감사를 드립니다. Thank you for blessing us to worship you, holding onto your promise even today. 약속대로 응답하시는 하나님, 증인 되게 하여 주옵소서. God blesses to be your witnesses, for you are God who carries out your promise. 내 속에 우리 속에 성삼위 하나님이 임하고 충만케 하여 주옵소서. May you, the whole, the Triune God, come uh, into our, come into us to the fullness, and may we be the witnesses. 하나님의 나라를 누리게 하여 주옵소서. And may we enjoy your kingdom, O God. 이삼칠 나라 복음화할 수 있을 만큼 하나님 능력을 허락하여 주옵소서. And may you grant us your power to the point of doing the two three seven evangelization. 오직 그리스도 안에 모든 것이 있음을 확인케 하여 주옵소서. Do bless us to confirm that there is truly everything in in the Christ only. 증인으로 현장 살리는 한 사람 되게 하여 주옵소서. May we be the one individual to save the field. 
언약의 예물로 나왔습니다. We have come before you with the covenantal offerings. 언약대로 보좌의 것으로 축복하여 주옵소서. According to your promise, may you give us the blessing from your throne. 세계 복음화 할수 있는 예물이 되게 하여 주옵소서. May these offerings be the offerings to be used for the world's evangelization. 명을 바꾸는 빛의 경쟁이 무엇인지를 보여줄 수 있도록. 주님 축복하여 주옵소서. Do bless upon us that we may be able to show what the light economy that changes our fate is. 운명을 바꾸고 교회를 살리고 현장을 살리는 예물이 되게 하여 주옵소서. May these offerings be the offerings that changes our fate and saves the field and the church. 이제는 십자가에서 모든 문제 해결하신 예수 그리스도의 은혜와 Now the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ who finished everything on the cross. 하나님의 놀라우신 사랑하심과 and the amazing love of our God the Father. 성령님의 충만케 하심이 and the uh, and the filling of the Holy Spirit. 언약적인 예배 생을 드리는 HMC 성도들 머리 머리 위에 upon the heads of all HMC members who are giving their life for the covenantal worship. 모든 것을 아시는 하나님께서 주신 그 이름을 붙잡고 40일 집중을 도전하려고 하는 성도들 머리 머리 위에. And upon the heads of those members who are uh, willing to challenge for this 40 days concentration of the 73rd batch for uh, holding on to the Christ who uh, uh, that which came from God who knows everything. 복음 누림의 증인으로 현장을 살리기 원하는 제자들 머리 머리. And upon the heads of those disciples who are willing to save the fields with the enjoyment of the gospel. 렘넌트들의 미래와 그 전문성 위에. And upon the future and the sense of expertise of the remnants. 산업인들의 업 위에. And upon the work, uh, the business of our businessmen. 전도자들 기도하는 모든 현장 위에. And upon the fields of all the uh, fields where the evangelists are praying for. 우리 가족들의 복음을 회복하지 못하고 예배를 회복하지 못하는 가족들 머리 위에. And also upon the heads of all the families who are not able to restore the worship and gospel. 전 세계에 흩어져 있는 HM 제자들 머리 머리. And upon the heads of all HMC disciples all around the world. 이제로부터 영원토록 함께 하실지어다. Be both now and always forevermore. Amen. Amen.